Greetings and a special welcome to all our former choristers from St. Mary's Cathedral in Limerick. This is our YouTube launch of the DVD, no, it's not a DVD, it's a CD that we have um, made for especially the choristers from our last four years at Limerick entitled Above All Praise and All Majesty. And we hope you all enjoy this CD, which is a wonderful memory of all our music making in the cathedral. And we wish you all the best for 2009, and hope you'll keep in touch. We'd love to hear from you. But first of all, we'll just take a quick look at what we've been doing since we left Ireland in 2004. We rented a barn in Hereford for um, two years. Um, lovely place in many ways, beautiful situation, high spec, under floor heating, but um, we were eventually glad to move away. And we moved up to North Yorkshire here, um, a fairly derelict farmhouse, a completely derelict stable block that you can see on the, on the right. Farmhouse needs a lot of updating, and one of the major problems we had was with the garden. There's about 100 tons of rubble here. So um, two and a half acres, so we had to spend a lot of time and money in doing this kind of thing. You can see we had to have some very heavy machinery, um, making sure that um, everything was um, sorted out, ground up, and then we had some new pathways made. You can just see in the back there the orchard. And there's two and a half acres, which includes a wildlife area, the orchard, a paddock, and um, loads of machinery. This all took place in 2008. Great firm, but they would insist on arriving at about quarter to seven every morning. So after over a week of this, I was kind of fairly wrecked. Um, but the, the workmen, who were all basically ex-farmers, did a magnificent job. They completely re-graveled the drive and did a huge amount of um, work for us in putting in new trains and uh, leaving the aspect very clear and tidy. Meanwhile, our real neighbours are the cows. Our next door farmers have beautiful cows and loads of sheep so that we can enjoy them just as much as we can enjoy some magnificent sunsets. They really are great. Meanwhile, this is our local parish church where you will find Francis Jackson, former very good organist of the Minster playing, playing a harmonium. We know him quite very well now and can get on famously. On the other side of us you will find such churches as this one with an Italian Renaissance triptych or the Church of Lord Halifax, famous as a foreign secretary in Britain and also for his attempts to bring Anglicans and Roman Catholics together at the beginning of the last century. But back to the CD, if there is a message, and there always is, it is that singing in this material world is one of the most developmental aspects of our life. Sound, after all, is the foremost of all our senses. It is the first to arrive when we are born, and it is the last to disappear when we die. Sight can often be an illusion, a computerised representation of vibrations to help us make sense of what is going on around us in terms of colour and materials. I could be anywhere. I could be here in York Minster, in the nave on a January morning when there are no pews or seats around. A wonderful vista of medieval architecture. I could be here in front of the screen with its carvings of the early kings of England and above it the magnificent organ of the Minster. Or I could revisit Limerick Cathedral as it was in the 90s during my term, my 24 year term of occupation. Or I might revisit the 2001 Advent Carol Service standing here in the Monk's Walk looking out over an expectant cathedral. Sight is an illusion, but sound to me is everything. So, thanks for enriching our lives with your singing your dedication and your friendship. Have a great 2009 and hope to see you sometime during then. But remember, the universe is also built on a sense of evolution. We evolved as a choir. What plans do you have for developing on a personal and spiritual plane in 2009? Oh, and incidentally, yes, you are right. 
The backing tracks I have used for this short video are from our Millennium CD of carols and the recent CD, Above All Praise and All Majesty.